Good morning, class. Today, I'm going to be dictating some lit briefs. And so uh, these are just phrases and briefs by common word, okay? So let me give you some strokes and words. Uh, look under your phrases and briefs by common word, okay? It'll have today's date and it's under handouts, class handouts, okay? And so um, these are real important. You have best of my ability, best of my ability, B-I-B-L-T, best of my ability, B-I-B-L-T, okay? Let's see if these come out. If not, control D because they don't come out of, as anything else. And that did come out. Best of my ability. Think of the best, B, my, I, ability, B-L-T. Best of my knowledge is B-I-J. Best of my, think of best as the best, I is my, knowledge is J. Best of my knowledge. And then you've got best of my recollection. Remember, these endings are the same as you have on your Q&A phrases. Do you recall? Do you have knowledge? Do you recollect? So best of my recollection is B-I-R-K. B-I-R-K. Best of my recollection. <clears throat> You've got best of your ability. B-U-R-B-L-T. B-U-R-B-L-T. Best of your ability. Think of best is B, your is you are, ability, B-L-T. Best of your knowledge, you'll hear this frequently, is B-U-R-J. B-U-R-J. Best of your knowledge. You've got best of your recollection. Best of your recollection is B-U-R-K. B-U-R-K for best of your recollection. And then you have... <clears throat> <clears throat> B-U-R-K, best of your recollection. You have just some briefs that you've already learned. Accident happened is S-D-A-P-D, S-D-A-P-D. Accident happened, defendant, D-F-T, initial D, final F-T. You've got driver's side. <clears throat> driver's side is D-R-D-Z, come back long E for the apostrophe, and it'll make it driver's side. Red light, R-L-T. Red light, RLT, and then you have did for, D is for did in phrases. D-A-O is do in phrases. D long E is for does in phrases, okay? So um, did you recollect, D-U-R-K, D-U-R-K for did. Did you recollect? You have do you recall. D long D A O U and then recall. Do you recall? You have does. Does he recall? D long E R L. Does he recall? Okay. And I'll have those handouts for you in Blackboard so you have them. Okay. And then just going over some briefs. Um, Again, accident, S-D-E-N-T. Remember, you need to practice these over and over. Accident in question, S-K or S-D-I-K. Answer is A-N-S. Anything else, N-I-G-L-S, N-I-G-L-S. You've got at the time, T-E-T -E asterisk, at the time. You have at this time, T-I-T -E asterisk. You have attorney is torn, automobile, A-U-B-L. Courthouse cross, K R O U S, courthouse, K R O U S, damage, D A J. I'm going a little faster on these because you should already know most of these. Day of the week, D long A F K, day of the week, D long A F K. You've got defendant, D F T. Guilty or not guilty, G O R N G, G O R N G. Jury is J U R. Lawyer, L-A-U-R, license, L long I-N-S, license is L long I-N-S, mortar vehicle is M long O-V-K, M long O-V-K, you've got number, N-U-R-M, number, N-U-R-M, number of, make sure you know number of, N-U-R-M, 
FRM, N-U-F-R-M, number of. And then you have number of witnesses is a brief. <clears throat> N-U-F-N-S. N-U-F-N-S. You have plaintiff, P-L-F. Plaintiff's attorney, Plorn. P-L long R-N. Plaintiff's attorney, Plorn. You have police, plis, P-L-I-S. You have question, Q-E. And I'm going over these because they're on a page and they're going to be in your speed building. You have scene of the accident, S-N-E-X, scene of the accident. Telephone is T-F-N, T-F-N. Time of the accident is N-E-F-X, N-E-F-X for time of the accident. Vehicle is VEEK, witness W-N-S, witness W-N-S, okay? So what I'm going to do is dictate some of these phrases, <clears throat> and hopefully you can remember them. If not, make some flashcards, okay? Here we go. Best of my ability. Best of my knowledge. Best of my recollection. Best of your Ability, best of your knowledge, best of your recollection. Accident happened, defendant, driver's side, red light, accident, accident in question, answer, anything else? At the time, at this time, attorney, automobile, courthouse, damage, day of the week, defendant, guilty or not guilty, jury, lawyer, license, mortar vehicle, number, number of, number of witnesses, Plaintiff, plaintiff's attorney, police, question, scene of the accident, telephone, time of the accident, vehicle, witness. Okay, and so now I'm going to give you some um, sentences incorporating these briefs. So make sure you make your flashcards and um, practice, listen to the phrases and write them down. And here we go. This is gonna be at 60 words a minute and I'm gonna start with the best um, briefs, okay? The best, best of my ability, B-I-B-L-T, best of my knowledge, B-I-J, best of my recollection, B-I-R-K, best of your ability, B-U-R-B-L-T, best of your knowledge, B-U-R-J, best of your recollection, B-U-R-K. Here we go, 60 words a minute to the best of your ability tell me how the accident happened to the best of my ability i will tell you why i can't work now to the best of your knowledge tell us what you heard the defendant say to the best of my recollection he told me to sit down or he would kill me to the best of your Recollection, describe your assailant to us. To the best of my knowledge, the man was about six feet tall. Tell me to the best of your ability 
how the accident happened. To the best of my recollection, the green car went through the red light and hit my car on the driver's side. Tell us, to the best of your knowledge, how you were hurt. I will do that to the best of my ability. All you can do is tell us to the best of your recollection. To the best of my knowledge, there were no other cars involved. And remember, um, assailant. Describe is drive, D-R long I-B. Assailant is a sale lent. There you go, a lent. okay? And this is gonna be at 70 words a minute. To the best of your ability, tell me how the accident happened. To the best of my ability, I will tell you why I can't work now. To the best of your knowledge, tell us what you heard the defendant say. To the best of my recollection, he told me to sit down or he would kill me. To the best of your recollection, describe your assailant to us. To the best of my knowledge, the man was about six feet tall. Tell me, to the best of your ability, how the accident happened. To the best of my recollection, the green car went through the red light and hit my car on the driver's side. Tell us to the best of your knowledge how you were hurt. I will do that to the best of my ability. All you can do is tell us to the best of your recollection. To the best of my knowledge, there were no other cars involved. Remember, involved is VOV, come back D, involved. You've got accident happened, SDAPD, accident happened. And this is going to be at 80. To the best of your ability, tell me how the accident happened. To the best of my ability, I will tell you why I can't work now. To the best of your knowledge, tell us what you heard the defendant say. To the best of my recollection, he told me to sit down or he would kill me. 
to the best of your recollection, describe your assailant to us. To the best of my knowledge, the man was about six feet tall. Tell me to the best of your ability how the accident happened. To the best of my recollection, the green car went through the red light and hit my car on the driver's side. Tell us to the best of your knowledge how you were hurt. I will do that to the best of my ability. All you can do is tell us to the best of your recollection. To the best of my knowledge, there were no other cars involved. Okay, and so now we're gonna use some um, do, did, and does. Remember, include your question marks at the end of the sentences, okay? Include punctuation. So you have, did you recollect? Did you recollect? Do you RKB, RK? You have, did you ever D U F R with an asterisk? Did you want D-U-P-T? Did you recall D-U-R-L? Did you remember D-U-R-M? You have, did you understand? D for did you and D-Z for understand. Did you understand? Did you have? Did is D-I-D and then you have is U-F, two strokes. Did you find? D U F N D. Did you find? D U F D U F N D. Did you find? Do you recall? Is D long U R L with an asterisk? Do you recall? Do you remember? D long U R M. Do you remember? Do you recollect? D long U R K. Do you recollect? Do you know? D long U N asterisk. Do you mean? D long U M. Do you think, D long U-N-G? Do you have, D long U-F? Do you feel, D long U-F-L? And I'll have this sheet in, in Blackboard as well, okay? Uh, do you ever, D long U-F-R? Do I understand? D long I N D Z. Do I understand? Do you want D long U P T? Does he recall D long E R L? Does he remember D long E R M? Do you recall D long U R L with an asterisk? And then let me go on to the next page. There's some more. You have, do you remember again, D long U R M? Did you recall D U R L? Do you think D long U N G? Did you find D U F N D? Do you feel D long U F L? Do you recall D long U R L with an asterisk? Did you remember is D U R M? Did you understand D U N D Z? Did you recall D U R L? Did you recollect D U R K? Do you recall D long U R L? Make sure you put in the asterisk because if you don't, it won't come out. If you if it doesn't come out and you like that stroke, then enter it. Control D and put in your dictionary for do you recall? Okay, and so. Um, Let's not forget accident. So I'm gonna give you the, the words now and you stroke them out and then I'll give them to you in sentences. Did you recollect? Did you ever? Did you want? Did you recall? Did you remember? 
Did you understand? Did you have? Did you find? Do you recall? Do you remember? Do you recollect? Do you know? Do you mean? Do you think? Do you have? Do you feel? Do you ever? Do I understand? Do you want? Does he recall? Does he remember? Do you recall? Do you remember? Did you recall? Do you think? Did you find? Do you feel? Do you recall? Did you remember? Did you understand? Did you recall? Did you recollect? Do you recall? And then just other words, accident, accident in question, answer, anything else at the time, at this time, attorney, automobile, courthouse, damage, day of the week, defendant, guilty or not guilty, jury, lawyer, license, mortar vehicle, number, number of, number of witnesses, plaintiff, plaintiff's attorney, police, question, scene of the accident, telephone, time of the accident, vehicle, witness. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna dictate these phrases and it'll be at 60 words a minute, okay? Incorporate your punctuation, you all. If there's a phrase you're hesitating at, write it down and practice it afterwards over and over and over. Practice reading it back so you recognize it, okay? This is at 60 words per minute. Make sure you include your punctuation. Did you recollect the name of the plaintiff's attorney? Did you ever go to another school before this one? Did you want to go to the drug store? Did you recall what the defendant told the police? Did you remember to call the witness into the hall? Did you understand the question and the answer? Did you have a good time at the courthouse? Did you find out the amount of damage to the vehicle? Do you recall the scene of the accident? Do you remember what you did last night? Do you recollect the name of the attorney? Do you know what day of the week it happened? Do you mean you don't remember the time of the accident? Do you think he is guilty or not guilty? Do you have anything else to tell us? Do you feel that she actually saw the accident? 
do you ever think about the scene of the crime? Do I understand you to say you were not there? Do you want this case to go to the jury at this time? Does he recall the accident in question? Does he remember where he was at the time? Do you recall the scene of the accident? And remember, let's see if it happened comes out. TP, yes, T final PD is it happened. Okay, and then we've got um, damage, DAJ, a vehicle leak, Courthouse Kraus, K R O U S, um, guilty, like that. Okay. And this is going to be at 70 words per minute. Did you recollect the name of the plaintiff's attorney? Did you ever go to another school before this one? Did you want to go to the drugstore? Did you recall what the defendant told the police? Did you remember to call the witness into the hall? Did you understand the question and the answer? Did you have a good time at the courthouse? Did you find out the amount of damage to the vehicle? Do you recall the scene of the accident? Do you remember what you did last night? Do you recollect the name of the attorney? Do you know what day of the week it happened? Do you mean you don't remember the time of the accident? Do you think he is guilty or not guilty? Do you have anything else to tell us? Do you feel that she actually saw the accident? Do you ever think about the scene of the crime. Do I understand you to say you were not there? Do you want this case to go to the jury at this time? Does he recall the accident in question? Does he remember where he was at the time do you recall the scene of the accident? Remember scene of the accident, S-N-E-X, S-N-E-X, scene of the accident. Okay, and then this is gonna be at 80 words per minute, 80 words per minute. Did you recollect the name of the plaintiff's attorney? Did you ever go to another school before this one? Did you want to go to the drug store? Did you recall 
what the defendant told the police. Did you remember to call the witness into the hall? Did you understand the question and the answer? Did you have a good time at the courthouse? Did you find out the amount of damage to the vehicle? Do you recall the scene of the accident? Do you remember what you did last night? Do you recollect the name of the attorney? Do you know what day of the week it happened? Do you mean you don't remember the time of the accident? Do you think he is guilty or not guilty? Do you have anything else to tell us? Do you feel that she actually saw the accident? Do you ever think about the scene of the crime? Do I understand you to say you were not there? Do you want this case to go to the jury at this time? Does he recall the accident in question? Does he remember where he was at the time? Do you recall the scene of the accident? And then going on to some more phrases. Uh, you have, do you remember? Did you recall? Do you think? Did you find? Do you feel? Do you recall? Did you remember? Did you understand? Did you recall? Did you recollect? Do you recall? And this is the rest of the sentences at 60 words a minute, I'll start off. Do you remember her name and address? Did you recall the license plate number? Do you think you can recall her name? Did you find any damage to the car? Do you feel you are fully recovered? Do you recall the name of the street you were on? Did you remember the color of the motor vehicle? Did you understand what the lawyer said to you? Did you recall the telephone number? Did you recollect the color of the automobile? Do you recall the number of witnesses? Remember, number of witnesses is N-U-F-N-S, okay? N-U-F-N-S. And um, what else? Let me see. I guess that's it. This is going to be at 70. Do you remember her name and address? Did you recall the license plate number? Do you think you can recall her name? Did you find any damage to the car? Do you feel you are fully recovered? Do you recall the name of the street you were on. 
Did you remember the color of the mortar vehicle? Did you understand what the lawyer said to you? Did you recall the telephone number? Did you recollect the color of the automobile? Do you recall the number of witnesses? Remember, do you recall? You put the asterisk in, okay? Do you recall? And then this is gonna be at 80 words per minute, 80 words per minute. Do you remember her name and address? Did you recall the license plate number? Do you think you can recall her name? Did you find any damage to the car? Do you feel you are fully recovered? Do you recall the name of the street you were on? Did you remember the color of the mortar vehicle? Did you understand what the lawyer said to you? Did you recall the telephone number? Did you recollect the color of the automobile? Do you recall the number of witnesses? And then I think I'm gonna do all of them, all the sentences at 80 words a minute, okay? Here we go, all of them together. 80 words a minute. To the best of your ability, tell me how the accident happened. To the best of my ability, I will tell you why I can't work now. To the best of your knowledge, tell us what you heard the defendant say. To the best of my recollection, he told me to sit down or he would kill me. To the best of your recollection, describe your assailant to us. To the best of my knowledge, the man was about six feet tall. Tell me to the best of your ability how the accident happened. To the best of my recollection, the green car went through the red light and hit my car on the driver's side. Tell us to the best of your knowledge how you were hurt. I will do that to the best of my ability. All you can do is tell us to the best of your recollection. To the best of my knowledge, there were no other cars involved. Did you recollect the name of the plaintiff's attorney? Did you ever go to another school before this one? Did you want to go to the drugstore? Did you recall what the defendant told the police? Did you remember to call the witness into the hall? Did you understand the question and the answer? Did you have a good time at the courthouse? Did you find out the amount of damage to the vehicle? Do you recall the scene of the accident? Do you remember what you did last night? 
do you recollect the name of the attorney? Do you know what day of the week it happened? Do you mean you don't remember the time of the accident? Do you think he is guilty or not guilty? Do you have anything else to tell us? Do you feel that she actually saw the accident? Do you ever think about the scene of the crime? Do I understand you to say you were not there? Do you want this case to go to the jury at this time? Does he recall the accident in question? Does he remember where he was at the time? Do you recall the scene of the accident? Do you remember her name and address? Did you recall the license plate number? Do you think you can recall her name? Did you find any damage to the car? Do you feel you are fully recovered? Do you recall the name of the street you were on? Did you remember the color of the mortar vehicle? Did you understand what the lawyer said to you? Did you recall the telephone number? Did you recollect the color of the automobile? Do you recall the number of witnesses? And then just the phrases, okay? Best of my ability, best of my knowledge, best of my recollection, best of your ability, best of your knowledge, best of your recollection, accident happened, defendant, driver's side, red light, accident, accident in question, answer, anything else, at the time, at this time, attorney, automobile, courthouse, damage, day of the week, Defendant, guilty or not guilty. Jury, lawyer, license, mortar vehicle, number, number of, number of witnesses. Plaintiff, plaintiff's attorney. Police, question, scene of the accident. Telephone. Time of the accident, vehicle, witness. And remember on the phrases for um, did, it begins with the D for do in phrases, D-A-O, and for does in phrases, D long E, okay? And so I think that's a good point to end our session. I'll be right back and I will be continuing with um, with lit speed building, okay? Lit speed building.